Today, we will show how to protect the CUI, especially the unstructured data using NextLab Digital Risk Management Solution. Organization need to be compliant with CMMC when it comes to unstructured CUI information. It's mandatory that such files are protected before sharing. NextLab Enterprise Digital Risk Management EDRM provides enhanced protection with advanced risk protection capabilities to ensure highly confidential CUI such as design document, IP documents, sensitive financial information is always secure. Also, automated right protection prevent inadvertence disclosure of restricted data, strengthening data protection anywhere and everywhere. In this use case, there are two demo users. Jay Tyler, who is an authorized user, has all the permission, such as downloading, editing, or viewing the file. On the other hand, Jay Carter, demo user 2, does not have permission to accept or take any activities with the document in SAP. Now, let's switch to the SAP system. When Jay Tyler, who is an authorized user, tries to access a CUI document, he is allowed to view the document. When the user tries to download the document with a copy to options, file gets downloaded. Let's look into the file. When the file gets downloaded, it gets extended with the document in the Excel extension. This indicates the file is protected with NextLab Dynamic Write Management. Let's look into the properties. Here, the user is permitted to view, print, reshare, save, or edit. He also has an option to watermark the file. When the user access the file, you can see the watermark provided. Now, when the same CUI document is tried to be accessed by an authorized user, that is Jay Carter. Asset is denied. As part of NextLab solution, NextLab provides a desktop client called SkyDRM, which allows users to log in to protect the download. We can see that J. Tyler login because he has all the permissions. Let me log out and log in as J. Carter. Now, when login as J. Carter, Let's try to access the same file. And the user is denied. To access this file, let's view the properties. User is not provided with any permissions. Let's quickly look into the policy. Here is the policy that defines the restrictions. There are two main components in this policy. One is the subject component where you provide the user information. The next component is the rights option, which allows or tell the system what sort of permissions need to be granted for this user, which is few clicks of options and no code involved. User is able to protect CUI file before sharing. This concludes our videos on how to protect the CUI, especially the unstructured data, using NextLab Digital Right Management DRM. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for our next video.